I expect a lot from the cream beam. Oh my god. Oh, look at that. Ooh. But this guy, he's cool as hell. Hey, bro, welcome back to another Terraria video. Today is a special video. Now, back in 2014, I remember little old game writers remember seeing a Terraria forum page with the words confection on it. And when I opened the forum page, boom, it was a whole entire idea about a whole new biome in Terraria. And here we are in 2021. The idea has finally come to life. We are here in the confection mod, which is an alternative to the hollow as you can see i killed everything in this world and as we can see it spread over here beautiful you like to see it first try i didn't have to make multiple worlds but yeah this is a dope mod i remember looking over the pictures back in the day and now that we're here we got a easily accessible modding system in team mod loader and it's honestly amazing to see this finally come to life it's awesome we got some biomes over here boom look desert we got some chocolate cactuses over here in the desert i'm assuming that's chocolate we go over here to the snow biome look at that we got some nice popsicles over here as the trees are very very cool but yeah let's get to it all right let us hop into it here let's start with the armor and vanity there is a lot of vanity in this and honestly i don't expect too much in terms of armor because if this is just literally a hollowed alternative then that works out perfectly fine but yeah let's start with the uh i guess i'll start with the armor so we have two armor sets here here we have the cream wood which is this wood here in the background boom cut it down cream wood beautiful let's build something amazing wow look at that amazing yeah just like the uh, hollowed wood or pearl wood boom put this on let's see what it looks like amazing it actually does look really cool what's the set bonus oh one defense all right let's check out the next set though we have the neapolonite armor here as you can see not bad stats at all boom put those on and then you get a bunch of different helmets to choose from you got a summoner helmet of course magic or mage you got melee you got range cool let's put them all on is there a different set bonus for each of them it looks like there is very very cool uh some of these helmets is definitely look cooler than others okay this one looks stupid <laughs> look like something out of uh adventure time or maybe even chowder uh what about this one boom got a really pointy head looks like a shell uh probably my favorite one's the melee one the melee one looks the coolest melee usually always looks the coolest though but yeah there you go there was the armors nice let us move on to the vanities now there's a lot of one-off vanities i believe aka vanities that don't have like a whole matching outfit of uh, that or i just don't know the matching outfits but let's start with this one the cookie one look at that you ever want to role play as a cookie guess what this mod allows you to do that you ever want to role play as a gummy bear boom you ever want to role play as willy wonka who doesn't want to role play as willy wonka look at that all Right, and then i believe we start getting into the one-off outfits here we got a top cake we got a i don't want to say that word cobbler great for impersonating confection creators now, i believe this is a reference to the original creator not the mod devs i don't know if the mod devs and the original idea the creator who made the original idea are the same people i don't think they are so i believe this is just like a homage to it to the original creator we, this looks really cool too uh we got some right trousers there you go there's a whole outfit that i made right there we have this thing the una cookie which is really cool looking look at this a very unique here boom <laughs> uh what else do we got we got cone head look at that we got cookie corset we got a birthday suit Ooh, look at fancy we got the admiral hat we have the cream hat we have the cake dress maybe this is an outfit yeah this might be an outfit and i believe that's everything maybe i missed like one thing i believe that's everything all right next up we have a bunch of wings here i believe these are all wings let me go ahead and take off my wings let's see them in action here we got the cookie ones boom and it spins that's funny see i was wondering how it was gonna flap or work but it just spins after that we got the cream wings does this one flap no nope, it kind of has like the cream dripping off that's cool we have the saccharite wings okay these ones look like they flap after that we have the sprinkle wings these are fairly normal looking wings and then we have the wild airy blue let's see how this works oh damn we got a hoverboard i love hoverboards all right there you go there's that let's move on here to a bunch of the uh pets and or mounts and or light pets don't know the specific order let's just see them in action here we got this one what the hell is this one it is a foaming float oh okay okay so is this a flying mount oh it is this thing is pretty fast all right after that we have a driver's permit some say roller cycle to ride on Ooh, 
Now this is dope. I like this. I kind of wish it was some animations, but other than that, it's amazing. Creativity is off the walls. After that, we got a pixie stick. Look at that. It's pretty much like the witch broom. Next up, we have a magical kazoo. Oh, makes a cool noise. We got a little like banana bird. After that, we got chocolate chunk. Spawns a little roller cookie to roll around with you. It's a material for something. What could this be a material for? Oh, it's for a weapon. Cool. Boom. Look at that. Wait. So is he a light pet? One of these is a light pet. Yeah, the bird is a light pet. We got creamy foxtail. Let's see it. Yep, that is a creamy fox indeed. Uh, we got a creamy sandwich. Some is a little creamy sandwich. I get it. Uh, we got a toasty toaster. Look at that thing. And then we got a taffy apple. Dudley. Nice. That one looks like a little pile of poo poo following me around all right we're moving on to the weapons here i have no specific order for weapons at all i just threw a bunch of them in here let's see them i'm actually gonna start with the bottom stuff here we have cherry bombs after detonation cherry shots will come out and explode we need a very simple enemy here i guess we should honestly check out some of the enemies from the mod but uh, obviously i don't want to summon in a bunch of them here i'll just summon in these guys the sweet gummies because they look like zombies sure let's test this stuff out on these guys hey don't run away this is like a really good grenade that's what this is after that we have sugar water spreads a convection to some blocks okay so this is not really a weapon but you can use it as a weapon next up we have the drixer uh i believe there's an alternative a pickaxe alternative too somewhere in here right here the picks and uh, i believe this does exactly what you think it does it's a pickaxe and an axe it's pretty much the drax but you know the confection version all right next up we have the grand slammer i believe this is just a hammer there's nothing to it it's literally just a hammer all right let's start from the top now we have the cookie crumbler oh look at that it shoots cookies i don't see no crumbling though i don't see no crumbling let's see let's spawn in an enemy no that's it it just shoots cookies okay nice and simple next up cream of kicking upon using right click a cookie will shoot out with increased speed but less damage upon using left a ball of meat will shoot out with increased damage. meat meat See, I don't think meat fits in with everything else. All right, let's see it. Left click. Oh, it's a flail or yeah, it is a flail. OG flail. All right, let's see the right click. Ah, look at that. Okay, so it has shorter range, but it's a lot faster. Moves a lot faster. Maybe does more damage. Increased speed, but less damage. Actually, it does less damage, but it's really fast. Okay, cool. Very unique. We have the Seer of Cavendus. I don't know what the hell that word is. It is a spear and it shoots bananas. Is that bananas? It looks like bananas. It's a really good spear though. Really fast. Next up, we have the Sucrosa. Boom. Let's summon in the yellow one. Let's see what this thing does. Oh, it's just like a plain old sword. Nothing crazy to it. Okay. On to the next. We have the yo-yo cookie. This is self-explanatory. It's a cookie. That's a yo-yo. Or yo-yo. That's a cookie. Whatever. After that, we have the true Sucrosa. This thing better do work. Oh, okay. We shoot little projectiles. Uh, we have the death's rays okay so you know you're looking at all of these you're like candy theme sugar theme and then we have death's rays so i expect a lot from death's rays okay it it does actually nothing i mean it's still a cool looking sword it looks like some uh, skyrim all right let's go ahead let's grab some more oh we got the true death's rays coming up i actually want to save like all the summon weapons for last so let me get everything that isn't summon weapons all right we got the true one what's the true one do i don't even know what the hell it's shooting but at least it shoots a projectile and the projectile looks like it pierces very very nice next up we got the sweet tooth does this do anything crazy i know there's a couple of arrows in the mod uh there's a cherry burst one there's a chip arrow there's a saccharite one this just seems like a really good bow cool uh we got this one the neopola knight one shoots three deadly arrows at the cost of only one i think deadly is just you know an adjective to make it sound cooler than it actually is but it's still not bad it's a really good bow next up we have the trifle I like that. That's a good play on words. Let's see it in action. Okay, so it's like pretty much a clockwork uh, assault rifle. Maybe a little bit better. Maybe easier to get your hands on. I don't know. It's pretty easy to get the clockwork on. Next up, the cream beam. Oh, I expect a lot from the cream beam. Oh my god. This not only has like some crazy looking effects, but like it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Here, summon in all four of them. Oh my god. All right, next up, the pop rocket fires four icy rockets after your enemies do i need anything was this magic oh okay so i don't even need ammo for it sweet it's a good rocket weapon well it's a mage weapon so not really a rocket after that we have the ice cream bell do you scream for ice cream we're about to see i'm about to make these gummy bears scream not bad look at that okay it's, it's fairly simple it's nothing crazy all right after that we have the cream spray 
Oh, I can't wait to spray cream on my enemies. And then we have the Crunch Ball. Launches a large rock candy ball. Not bad. All right, we are on to the minions here. Let's organize them by damage. Boom. All right, let's start with the gummy one. Oh, so we summon in gummy fish. This is kind of cool. I kind of wish they were red, you know, Swedish fish. And I kind of wish that, honestly, they weren't just retextures of the, uh, what's it called? What's the name of that fish pet? Oh, it's right here. The Zephyr fish. Like, are these not just retextures? Yeah, they are just retextures. Okay, they could be a little bit more creative there. And then at least if you're not going to be, like, creative and make your own sprite about them, at least make them red. Come on, Swedish fish. But still, they're cool. They're cool. Let's go ahead, spawn in some gummy enemies, of course. See what kind of damage they can do i am in an expert world so uh they might have a little bit of trouble all right next up we have let's do the gastropod one so we got little tiny gastropods very nice no gastropods they usually beat my ass when i'm in the hard load especially in like master mode or expert so i expect these things to do some work here come on y'all can do better than that come on so it seems like they sit still and they shoot so they're kind of like century hybrids all right now let's check out this next one. Oh, these guys did not be summoned why did they not be summoned all right pastry staff summons a little meowser is that what that says meowser to fight for you yeah let's see it in action here look at that so it's just like that pet we had earlier i expect this thing to do some work because it looks like they're about to shoot like rockets or something oh yeah i was pretty much right they're shooting something not exactly like exploding rockets but they're shooting something okay these ones are too bad their ai kind of seems like the gastropod one so that could use a little work honestly all right next up or last is the sweet staff all right, these guys did not de-summon either. What the hell? Sweet staff. Let's see it in action. Okay, so we just got some rolling cookies here. Come on, do some work. We need one of these summons to do work. There we go. Not bad at all. These actually might be hard mode summons because they're keeping up with the damage. But there you go. There was a majority of the weapons. I might have missed a couple here and there. But now let's get on to the juicy stuff. Oh my god, they never de-summon when I turn them off. And that juicy stuff being a bunch of the enemies. All right, so we obviously saw the uh, gun gummy bears here very very cool i like the idea of them it makes sense to have enemies like this sounds like they have mummy ai uh we have the striped pig Ron. look at that maybe i should like get out of god mode so they can hit me hit me okay that is not bad damage i know i'm not wearing armor but that is still not bad next up we have the sprinkling let me see this thing in action okay so we got a little flying dude does a lot of damage oh my god next up the sprinkler oh okay so we got like something that sits on the floor and shoots projectiles uh let me get hit by one of the projectiles 100 got a lot of heavy damage dealers oh and once you kill it it turns into a sprinkling very cool after that we have a sherbet slime or sherbet slime however the hell you pronounce it or want to pronounce it is what i should say look at this a very unique idea for a slime i like it he also drops a bunch of bricks very cool i'm probably not going to show off any of the like blocks or building stuff but they do have a lot of cool blocks you can build with in this mod very like alive and vivid blocks all right next up we have the roller cookie is that santa claus on it let's get hit by damn everything does a lot of damage i'm assuming these are all hard mode enemies because this is literally a hollowed biome alternative so all of these are gonna hit pretty damn hard but we got the regular roller cookie not bad great enemy idea parfait slime look at that parfait all the ideas for the enemies and like weapons so far they're all just awesome i think like everything like fits in perfectly so far the theme for this is awesome i think actually the turret devs at one point said they had a idea for an alternative of the hollow i don't remember if it was candy themed also or not but i know they had an idea about an alternative hollow might have to look in deeper for that uh we have a mint junior which is like a meteor cool next up we have the meaty mummy what's up with all the meat stuff is this like for like crimson i don't know <laughs> is the crimson meat themed i guess it is if you think about it uh we have an ice screamer this is probably gonna hurt getting hit by this guy i know the same damage as everyone else he looks really cool though there is a lack of animation in him which i'm noticing in a couple of things but as this mod updates more and more i'm assuming all this stuff is gonna be ironed out because this is still a fairly new mod it came out like a couple weeks ago maybe a month ago at this point and i was gonna check it out originally but then like it didn't have like all the content or a bunch of the content that the uh, forum had the original forum post had so i waited for a little bit and here we are it has a good bit of the content if not all of it by now this is a cool enemy the hunger i like this one very simple idea very cool next up foam and float we saw Oh, this this is probably where you get the mount honestly uh we got a crooked cookie another rolling cookie which is a staple for this mod a lot of rolling enemies uh we have pip pip 
This is, I'm assuming that's a critter. Gummy worm, also assuming this is a critter. Grumblebee, critter. Chocolate frog, critter. Chocolate bunny, of course a critter. Cherry bug, cool. See, look, this animation is very nice. Like, they, they could definitely do some animations. So I'm hoping something like this gets some cool animations. I'm hoping uh, the bike mount that we saw, I hope that thing gets some animations because I feel like that thing would look cool with animations. All right, so we might be getting into some bosses here. Let's start with this one, Confection Mimic. So it's just the Mimic. We honestly, this is expected uh, from anything that adds in biomes. They usually always add in mimics, which is always a good fit for Terraria. Boom. Did not drop anything crazy, but it's fine. All right. Birthday cookie. We got another cookie. Oh, it's a sugar cookie. Let's go ahead. Let's kill this thing. Actually, I should probably see like how much damage it does. Let's see here. Okay. Nice 126. That's pretty high. Next up, crazy cone. Oh, look at that. So this is just like the, uh, the, the hollowed swords and crimson axes, whatever that chase you underground. Cool. Cool. All right. So we have the cream sandwich next. I don't know which one to spawn in. Oh, look, she spawns in her own enemies too. All right. Hit me 160. That's pretty high. Let's go ahead. Let's kill her. And she has a second form or first form. I don't know. Maybe this is just like a completely different enemy. She spawns in the uh, mint juniors. Okay. So she spawns in a lot of enemies. Oh yeah. Okay. So when you kill her in that form, she goes into this form. That's cool. All right. We are coming down to our last things here. Let's start with this one. Wild Willy. Look at that. Is that supposed to be Willy Wonka? Boom. Yep. He drops all the stuff for it. And last but not least, this was the main thing I was waiting for to do a video on. And that is the boss right here or mini boss. The unfirm he doesn't have any animations yet i'm assuming again they'll iron that out later on but this guy he's cool as hell he looks cool he's like a big marshmallow he's got the little like admiral hat on very very cool i like this guy can't wait for him to get some animations and some attacks let's see him actually hit me 162 that's up there that's up there yeah let's go ahead and kill him i don't think he's gonna drop too much right now marshmallows <laughs> you forget that those exist in Terraria sometimes but yeah honestly i think that's it for the mod quickly we could just go through the uh cheat sheet thing here you guys can look at a couple more things there's a couple cool things here i believe some fishing things right here uh there's this thing dimensional split when you use places a portal and when clicked on a npc teleports to the first portal see now this just sounds super unique boom there's the portal okay i have no idea how it works with npcs do i just like spawn in like a random town npc or do I have to like drop them through it? I don't know. Oh. Oh, that's really cool. So when's if I put them like over here and then I click on them? Boom. Dropped his ass in a hole. That's cool. I like that. That's very unique. Cool way to, you know, move NPCs around. But yeah, there's a lot of cool furniture and stuff. Of course, the furniture is going to be really unique given the theme of the mod. More fish. There's a grappling hook. I didn't show this off, but uh. You know, it's a grappling hook, is what you expect. But yeah, other than that, very cool mod. Honestly, might play with it in future mod packs just to have that hollowed alternative. And once it's, you know, fully finished, completely like updated and has everything that they want to add in perfectly added in and animated it's gonna be a great alternative to the hollow and i always love things like this where i can have alternative to stuff it's pretty much like more vanilla content but yeah make sure to check out the mod make sure to check out the og forum post too i'm sure a couple of you have seen it in the past i remember looking at it all the time and i'm like damn i wish there was actually a mod for this and now there is so shout out to everyone that worked on it i'll see you guys in a future video have a good one